Hello my friends, let me show to you one case in which I used the mini implant as indirect anchorage. At this point, I'm distalizing the molar using the premolar as anchorage with a loop to distalize the molar. But the stability of the movement will be provided by the mini implant as an indirect anchorage. After opening the space, now I need to move the premolar from the palatal side to the buccal side. And there is a problem here. When we do this type of movement using the line of action of the force at this height, meaning at the height of the center of the crown, I'm generating also a moment. So if you pay enough attention, you're seeing that here we have the buccal movement of the, the crown, but the root is still in position, still palately displaced. Because of that, I will need to do a torque. What type of torque am I doing here? It's very difficult to use a continuous arch mechanics to correct this type of torque. So I'm also using the mini implant that I have to uh, give an auxiliary mechanics for this type of movement using the box loop with a TMA for correcting the inclination of the crowd. And after a while, everything is going to be fine. See you soon.